it's Remy and welcome back to my channel. Today I'm coming at you guys with a huge, huge, huge clothing haul for back to school. I haven't done a haul in so long, you guys. I have missed doing these for you guys. I've had so many people asking me if I can come back and share with you guys my style and things that I buy to wear and all that sort of stuff. This is gonna be so much fun and if you guys like this video and you wanna see more hauls, be sure to give this video a big thumbs up. Also, please subscribe to my channel if you guys haven't already. We are getting so close to two million subscribers. Thank you guys so, so much. Also, if you guys didn't know, I do have a vlog channel where I vlog basically all of my behind the scenes and like my everyday life and everything. So that will be linked down below. Every day we're getting closer to 1 million subscribers on there, which is just insane. So thank you guys for everything and I love you. Let's get started. All right, so getting started. No, I am not going back to school this year, but let me just say that everything that I have here is stuff that I would have worn when I was in school. So this is not only a haul, but it's also just to give you guys inspiration. If you are going back to school and things that are on sale right now, things that they're selling that I personally would wear if you guys like my style. And yes, as you can tell by this big pile of clothes back here, I have a lot to show you. I also have some more stuff on the floor. So we're just gonna go because I'm gonna talk a lot. All right, so the first store that I wanna show you guys stuff that I got from is Wild Fox. If you guys didn't know, I am Wild Fox's biggest fan. I will say their stuff is pretty expensive. It's definitely not cheap, but a life hack. If you guys wanna get them for half off, you can go to Nordstrom Rack and find them there for like way better prices. But also if you guys know me, I definitely get my money's worth out of my Wild Fox jumpers and sweatshirts and things like that. I wear them about six out of seven days of the week, if not seven days out of the week. I haven't done a haul in so long, I forgot how to do this. So this is the first one here. This is the summer sweater style, which is my favorite right now. So it looks like this, it's this really pretty blue color. I've worn this a ton already. And on the front, there is a really cute map of Los Angeles, but it's actually just like really funny and super sarcastic. At the top, it says like struggling actors near like the Hollywood area, celeb sightings in this area. Here's the valley, worst traffic. I just thought it was super cute. I also got the same style sweatshirt in this pink one and it says pageant queen runner up, which I thought was hilarious. This one is light pink and it has a V-neck and then it says internet hangover on the front, which I thought was perfect for me considering that I spend about 100% of my life online. I also got this sweatshirt here, which is a really pretty ombre color. It goes from like a blue to a pink to a white. And on the front, it says, life is a dream that keeps me from sleeping. Truth. I got this, which is actually a zip up hoodie and it's white, which I am so scared to wear this. I do not want to get it dirty. So I'm going to be extra, extra, extra careful in this, but there are flowers all over the sleeves. In the back, there's daisies. We all know how much I love daisies. And last but not least from Wild Fox, I picked up a t-shirt. I love their t-shirts because they're really thin and really comfortable, but they're not like so thin. You need to wear like a shirt underneath them. I hate when that happens. And I thought this was really, really funny. This might be really annoying of me, but it says lifestyles of the internet famous. And I just liked the blue. I love navy blue, so I can't wait to wear this. Moving on to the next store, which is my new favorite store in the history of the world. It's called Show Me Your Moo Moo, and I've seen a ton of girls wearing their stuff online, and it is so cute. So I don't know if you guys saw, but at VidCon, I actually wore these shorts, which I picked up from the site. Flowy shorts, there's like a really nice, comfy, elastic waistband, and then they're super flowy. They almost look like a skirt, and they're like just as comfortable as a skirt. I love me some flowy shorts, so I bought these, I fell in love with them, and then I bought them in pretty much every pattern I could find. And then I also found them in black, which means that they are going to match with literally everything. I also got white ones, this really fun blue pattern, which I'm going to Mexico tomorrow, and I will definitely be rocking these. And I also found this style of short, which I thought were also super cute. I got them in this Birds of Paradise pattern, which I love Birds of Paradise, and I love these like tropical colors. And I also got that style in this pattern here, which is so pretty. Like, does this not scream Greece to you? If I ever make it to Greece one day, I will definitely be wearing these. I think they are are perfect. And then to go along with those shorts, I also got both of the matching tops, which I am just as obsessed with. If you guys know me, this is pretty much my favorite style of shirt ever. I'm actually wearing one right now. It's like the off the shoulder tops like this. This one's super, super flowy. So it's really flattering on especially my body type. So here's the blue one. I have it in white and that's what I wore to VidCon with those pink shorts. And then I also got the Birds of Paradise pattern, which just screams like Hawaii or someplace tropical to me. I also found some dresses and rompers on the site that I really, really like. This is a dress that I found. It has a deep V, so when I wore this, I just wore a plain tank top underneath and then paired it with a denim jacket. And it's this really cool pastel, like watercolor print. And I also got it in my favorite thing, which is palm leaves, or I think these are banana leaves actually, some sort of leaf pattern. Just very cute, perfect if I was going to Hawaii and just brings a little bit of like tropical flair into my everyday life. And last but not least from Show Me Your Moo Moo, I picked up two of their rompers, which are the cutest things ever. They're a little hard just to show on camera, but essentially, 
essentially they go like this. It's almost like a little top in the front that ties. So there's little strings that you can tie in the front. And then there's actually a cutout in the middle. So it shows a little bit of your tummy. So this is definitely for more of my college friends out there. And then it's just attached to these really cute flowy shorts. And then I also found it in this light purple like lilac floral pattern, which I think is so, so pretty. Moving on, if you guys love flowy shorts and skirts as much as I do, but you're looking for some cheaper alternatives, I found some cute ones at Target that I love. First up, I found this pair of like jade green flowy shorts from Target, which I think are so, so cute. They remind me so much of the shorts I just showed you, but at a fraction of the cost. I think they have some other colors, and if you guys like these, I would head over to your Target ASAP to go pick them up. Also, you guys know how much I love my skirts. Found these at Target as well. They are like a corduroy material, and these are like my favorite skirts ever right now. This one is this like black floral pattern. I know this isn't everybody's cup of tea. It kind of is like a grandma print, but I thought it was cute, and I love grandmas. And I loved it so much that I also picked it up in this mauve purple color, which I have worn both of these multiple times already. Like, I've already washed them because I love them so much, and I've been wearing them like a little too often, so if you guys like these, go pick them up at Target. They are such a good deal and such great quality. I didn't realize how many skirts that I picked up, but another skirt that I got from Urban Outfitters that I really, really like is this skirt here. I know it's very different, and to me, it just kind of like screams tennis skirt. It's this like really cute coral orange, like terry cloth material, and then it has white piping down the sides of it and around the bottom, and I feel like this would be perfect to wear to back to school. And also at Urban Outfitters, I picked up another pair of shorts. These are the softest sweat shorts in the entire world. They're like this dark gray color. I'm actually wearing the light gray ones right now. I've been wearing them like constantly for the past couple years. I love them. They are so, so comfortable and perfect just to throw on and look cute, but also super casual. And last but not least from Urban Outfitters, I picked up this top here. I have no idea what this design is, but I saw it and I was like really drawn to it. It says gotcha on the front and then has these like dress shirts with pineapple stems coming out of it. I have no idea, but I imagined wearing it with like black denim shorts and like some really cute white sneakers or just something really cool and kind of like a little bit edgier. So I don't know, we will see. Moving on to the next store, I picked up some things from my friend Tiffany's store called Live and Jazz. If you guys have never shopped her site, you have to. I will link it down below. She has the cutest things ever and I am just obsessed with everything and I'm obsessed with her. She's one of my besties. First up, I picked up a pair of shoes from her and these are the most comfortable shoes in the world. This is my second pair of pink ones and I also own them in blue and in gray. They have memory foam on the inside and they kind of remind me of the Yeezys. I got this dress here that is so incredibly soft. So much of her stuff reminds me of things from Urban Outfitters but just for way cheaper. It's this really pretty blue color and it has a v-neck in the front and then it's just a really flowy shift dress which is going to be so comfortable to wear and my new favorite thing is cinching in the waist of my dresses with a little mini belt. So I think this is going to look really cute with a little belt. I got this little gray cutoff shirt that says fresh vibes. I love the font on it which I know sounds really weird to say and I loved this next top so much that I got it in both colors. If you guys watched my back to school outfit ideas video, Tiff actually wore this in that. So it crosses in the front and then it has these little pom-poms on the sleeves which I love pom-poms. So I got it in pink and then it also comes in navy blue which I am so excited to rock both of these. And then last but not least from Tiff's store I got this shirt which she actually named after me. So this is the Remy top and it looks like this which is this not such a me top I know. It is a v-neck white lace top. It has this really cute detail in the back that has like a little hello open slit with a little button at the top and it's just really dainty and feminine and will look cute with all of my flowy shorts. I just thought about all the outfits I could wear with my flowy shorts. Next up, I went to a store called Owlfish, which they have at a bunch of my malls around me now. It's an awesome store that has super cute and trendy things for really, really, really affordable prices. First of all, I picked up two of my favorite bras. Yes, I know I talked about these and said I hated them. It turns out I wasn't applying them correctly. Now I'm obsessed with them, you guys. And I picked up two black ones because they were only like $8 there and on Amazon they're like 20 so I scooped them up. First of all, I got this top here, which again, I love the over the shoulder or whatever. These are cold shoulder top things. This one is like a white with a little black speckle design, but what really drew me in was the little bead detailing here at the bottom. I thought it was so cute. I am also a sucker for bodysuits. I love wearing bodysuits underneath my little flowy shorts and then wearing them with like denim jackets or like a sweater or something. So I picked up a couple just plain cotton bodysuits. So I got a black one and then I also got a maroon like reddish one. I got this little black crop top here that has a little tie up the front, which I am a sucker for these 
whole tie thing. And then I also got another bodysuit. This is a white one, again, with a tie in the front. It's the two things that I just showed you mixed together. And then last but not least from this store, I just picked up a couple of these little like tube top things. I've been seeing girls wear these all the time. Personally, for me, I don't have the self-confidence to wear just this, but I figured they'd be perfect to wear underneath like more low cut tops and things that have like open sides and things. So I got a white one. And then I also just got like a black one and they're just like ribbed like this, and they were $14.99. I also picked up a few things from Nordstrom. First of all, I just got this white ruffle cami top from Topshop. I actually own this already, and then I spilled something and it stained, so I needed to get a new one because I love this. But yeah, simple as that, just a white ruffle top. That's about it. I also got this gray little like knot skirt thing. It's stretchy, it's super, super comfortable, and I just like the little design in the front. I thought it was so different. And then last but not least, one of my favorite things in this entire haul, I picked up this graphic tee that just really caught my eye. It says the future is female, which I thought was so empowering and I just really needed this in my life. So I picked this up and I can't wait to wear it. And then last but not least, I picked up a few things from Forever 21. These are just super random basic things, but they were such good deals. I couldn't pass them up. First of all, I got another white bodysuit. The quality is really, really nice. It's got a cute little v-neck in the front and I'm sure I'll be wearing this a lot. I get asked all the time what I wear underneath my dresses and like my flowy shorts and things like that so that my butt doesn't show. I buy almost almost all of my spandex from Forever 21. But these are awesome because they're really affordable. They're great quality. I've had the ones that I've been wearing lately for the past like couple years and they're still in like great condition. And yeah, you can pick up a pair for $12.90 and they will last you forever. I don't normally wear accessories. The only things I really wear are earrings, but I saw this and I figured I would wear it a lot. It's this really cute little crystal rhinestone choker, which is so adorable. And I feel like it really just like dresses up any outfit. So if you wanna show up to back to school and looking like bomb and you're here to slay, I feel like this will do it. So that wraps up my back to school haul. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Thank you so, so much for watching. If you guys like this and you wanna see a fall haul or just more hauls in general, be sure to give this video a big thumbs up. Please subscribe to my channel if you haven't already and I'll see you next time. Bye.